This sequence uses a hard ball to press into all of the muscles and tissues at the base of the skull and then up and down either side of the skull. It's done in a lying down position, which is the most stable and uh, secure position to do it in. So I'm going to turn away from you and show you where I'll be positioning the ball and then I'll get into position. I'm also going to be holding the ball in this fashion so I can hold it still and move myself around on top of the ball. So to begin with I'm going to position the ball right at the base of the skull just on one side so it's pressing into fleshy bits more than any bony structures but it will be a bit of both and I'll be holding like so. So I'll lie down and the ball is right at the base of the skull on the left hand side. I've got my feet flat on the floor. I feel completely comfortable and I just settle there and feel what it feels like. Can I relax? I can add some little movements of the head and neck on top of the ball. I can add some much bigger movements in a rotational sense because I'm holding the ball still. It's completely stable doing it like this. Then I'm going to do a little bit of a chin to chest and a little bit of a lifting my hips off the floor so that I can smoothly reposition the ball a little bit further up the skull. And then if it helps me relax, and it's all about relaxing and letting the ball press in, I settle my hips back on the floor. But if you wanted a stronger effect, then lift the hips up and press down through the heels and that will really press you onto the ball a little bit more. And from here, I can do some little side to side movements. And now the ball is moving a little bit more to my left. And if I add a rotation of my head to the left, all sorts of other tissues get pressed into. As many variety of movements that you can. Here I'm doing circles with my chin on top of the ball. More rotation. And then in a secure way, I slide or roll the ball a little bit further up the skull and again, explore movements. Wow, there are so many sensitive spots there. This is such a nice way, nice being a relative term, to get into those. Oh, I could stay here for hours. All right. If you've still got the hips up, let them lower down and just rest there. F you feel this kind of radiating washing sensation all through that side of the skull that you've just been working on. Then of course you'd try the other side. Give that one a go.